several hundred years after the fall of human civilization. It was a lawless period. A time without order. Only blood, flesh, bone, and iron. It was also a time of sorcery. Having been terrorized by demonic creatures their entire lives, human beings were miserably inadequate and forced to subsist in a barren Bastille environment. To think that their military is the most powerful in Judas, and we crush them easily. When has any army been enough to stop the four lords of Havoc? Of course we were victorious, and now the first seal is ours. But remember, Abigail, there are four seals which imprison the God of Destruction. That means there are three more we must obtain before we can resurrect it. After that, there'll be no force in existence which can hope to stand against us. Exactly. When the God of Destruction lives again, we will lay waste to all and build on its ashes the legendary Sorcerer's Kingdom. Our city's under attack, and half our warriors are guarding the king on his royal expedition. I suppose now we're gonna have to evacuate. You go! go! Boy, you gonna be happy! Uh -huh. Luce, how many times have I told you to knock before coming into a lady's room? I'm sorry, Yoko. Well, just remember to knock. Mm-hmm. So, what did you <laughs> want? Guess what? I washed some laundry for you. I hope you don't mind. You washed my clothes? Uh-huh. Here's your panties. <laughs> Boy, I blew it. <laughs> you fool. Why did Yoko get mad at me for washing her panties? Oh, hey! <laughs> Stand your ground! If we fail, the city is lost! Our courage will carry the day! Titus, put your ears! The walls are falling down! I've got to find Luce and get him out of here! Luce! Huh? Now what is he up to? What do 
you think you're doing? Oh, what's up, Yoko? Luce, the city's under attack. What are you doing here at the fountain? I'm washing your panties, Yoko. I thought you were mad because I only washed one pair when you had so many. Oh, idiot! You didn't! Oh, are you out of your mind? Enemy forces are invading the city, and you're out here doing laundry? Forces are far too powerful for even our warriors to have a chance to stop them. Great Priest Geo, word has just come that the Kingdom of Judas has fallen. Judas? Then they've won the first battle. And the Four Lords of Havoc now have the first seal in their possession. They follow the God of Ultimate Evil, the God of Destruction once burned the world to ashes in seven days. Ansla Sax, our kingdom Metarikana is the last stronghold against the resurrection of the God of Destruction. The Four Lords of Havoc will stop at nothing to crush us, but we will not fall to them. And so, in order to stop the invincible sorcerer Kebi Dabu, it's time for us to use our one ace in the hall! I do hope you weren't huh? hurt. Huh? Are you all right, Yoko? Princess Sheila, you're all right. Our priests have created a ward of protection around the altar. It will protect us for now. We'll just have to hold out till the king returns with his forces. We can't fight them off alone. A mm -hmm. ward won't save us if they bring the castle tumbling down on top of us. And the ward won't keep out the beast that's with them, princess. We should make our escape while we still have the chance. Yoko, the time has come for you to be given a secret spell. This spell will allow you to use the holy power and release the ancient wizard who has been locked away within the body of an unsuspecting innocent. There are many dangers in casting this spell, but now, with our kingdom in ultimate peril, there is no choice. Prepare yourself, Yoko. For the spell to be effective, your mind must be strong body chaste and pure. What did he mean, chaste and pure? Maybe the priests are right and we should evacuate. The city has fallen. There's no sense in all of us dying. Evacuate? I wish with all my heart it was otherwise. But we've got to face back. Princess Sheila. <gasps> Great priest, you're here. What's going on? Great Priest Geo was one of our mightiest protectors in the war 15 years ago. Tell us, is there some way we can save Metarikana? Metarikana may yet be saved if we act quickly enough. You mean we can still save the city? Hmm. Oh? Mm -hmm. Father, the spell. What is it that I have to do? The holy seal within you must... break! Ah! No! The seal must be broken, Yoko, or the Four Lords of Havoc will destroy everything we stand for. What is this holy seal? Yes, what could this holy seal be? As priests, we have the ability to protect and care for our comrades. But if we are to fight back against enemies this unbeatable, we must have an experienced wizard with formidable powers. There is such a wizard, but he can only be released if Yoko's seal of purity is broken. Ah! 
Great priest, now is the time to break the seal. Miss Yoko. Oh, Miss Yoko. Miss Yoko. Hmm. I don't want to. Oh. Yoko, please make the sacrifice for us. Whatever the price of this ceremony, remember what will happen if you don't go through with it. Think of all the people who will die if you don't do it. Oh. <laughs> It's just too embarrassing. Uh, what? It's embarrassing? <laughs> Yoko, in order for any of us to live, you've got to release the power that is deep within your young friend, Lucien. And to awaken that power, you must invoke the spell by breaking your seal of purity. Prepare yourself. For the seal of purity can only be broken with the power of a virgin's first kiss! But wait, Father! What if I'm not the right person for the spell? What if there's another girl who's more pure? You're the only one who can do it. Is there something that I should know? Um, I absolutely refuse! Lord Kelsu. We have a report from the 7th Army which was ordered to attack Metericana. The sorcerer Kibidabu is moments away from entering the castle. Very well. Not bad work for a fool like Kebidabu. Perhaps the sorcerer Kebidabu is a fool, but he's a powerful one. A pitiful kingdom like Metericana would offer him no resistance. <laughs> I remember it now. Hey, that was almost 15 years ago. The day we four and the invincible sorcerer Dark Schneider burned the kingdoms to the ground. <laughs> it's best not to dwell on it. That mage perished in that final conflict over 15 years ago. But remember, no one's invincible. Now you face Fondrobina, captain of the Knights of Metaricana! What fool! Metaricana has no one mightier to offer me! You haven't beaten me yet! Give up! <laughs> Damn you! My pride will never die! <laughs> In order for any of us to live, you've got to release the power that is deep within your young friend, Lucian. Uh, uh, what's going on? Look at your face. Why are you blushing? No! Be quiet. Just sit there. Accept this. In the name of Eno Marta, our beloved goddess of beauty, break now this seal. You said you were still a virgin! Ah! Father! You give me a bad reputation! This girl's chastity is a hundred percent! Um, well, eighty percent perfect. Whatever! Oh! Hmm? What's happening?
After all these years, I am alive again! What power is this? I've never sensed anything like it! What... what happened to Luce? What have you done with him? I am Luce, but the spell has transformed me. Now I am Dark Schneider, the most powerful wizard in the world. <gasps> Come. Ah! On your feet. Ah! Ah! He's... he's completely different. You mean all this time the boy was holding within him the presence of Dark Schneider? Imagine all it took to release him was a simple kiss. Dark Schneider? My brother's enemy. Uh, welcome back, Dark Schneider. Uh, I, uh, Dark Schneider, we're in great danger. We'll give you any reward, anything you want, if you'll just help us. Use your black magic to smash our enemies and lead our forces to victory! <laughs> I think not. Huh? huh? You, you think, think not? not? Have you no obligation? We brought you back from the dead. Destroy our foes and we'll pay you handsomely. Shut up. I'm not a sword for hire. I've got my own plan. I'm going to make the whole world my kingdom. <gasps> but first, I believe I'll have your head, Great Priest Geo. Hmm. Did you think I'd forgotten? My defeat 15 years ago, mere moments before becoming master of the world? And you were one of the five people who handed me that defeat, Cleric. You were the one who transformed and imprisoned me. And now that I'm free again, I'm going to make you pay for what you did! <laughs> but the enemy forces are coming! Luce, this can't be happening. Die, Geo! Die! Wait, stop! You can't do this! You said half of you is Luce! Well, he would never do something this awful! You see, the Great Priest is my enemy. My hatred for him demands that he be destroyed. And besides, butchering your father is a fitting way to begin anew my conquest of the world! <laughs> no! It can't be. This isn't the Luce I know. Hurrah! <gasps> Hurrah! Dark Thunder of Balmor! Sorcerous energies are intense! Their aura is sending Hidra into a frenzy! Now you die, old man! I... I have to stop him! I have to try! I've got to do something! But... But I'm too scared to even move! Heli, heli, now Holy spirits become our shield and protect us! Very impressive, Great Priest. But I can do better. Look out! <laughs> Burning in the depths of the pits of darkness. Let the fire of the to the Invincible Sorcerer! Kibidabu, Master of Hydra, Hydra of Five Heads, and First Disciple of Gaul, Future Ruler of the World! Hmm. Hmm? A magician? The power I sensed before could not have come from one so lowly as you. Take me to the source of these energies, magician. If you do, the Invincible Sorcerer, Kibidabu, will grant you a swift me. and painless Yoko. death. That hurt. I've never met such a lowbrow sorcerer. <laughs> My brow isn't that low. Take a look at this. You drew blood, you blundering idiot. Now get down here so I can have a better look at your face when I blow you to pieces. On second thought, stay there. The Hydra's less ugly. <gasps> You 
arrogant cur! Destroy him, Hidra! Kill him a million times over! You were foolish to provoke me! And now you die! Feast Hidra and devour his body! <laughs> Because you've really managed to make me very angry. First of all, you interrupted me when I was about to slaughter the great priest. And even worse, you drew blood right here on my face. But the biggest mistake you've made today was nearly killing Yoko with your foolhardy entrance. <gasps> and for that, you die! Zazam, Zazam, or Talm, Talm, and no, not that! Not that! Don't do it! Don't do it! Burning in the depths of the pits of darkness! Let the fires of hell take you! No! You can't do this! Help me, somebody! Let the fires become my sword and strike you down! Then I'll... Turn. We should never have <laughs> freed this demon. <laughs> Luce, stop it, please! Don't kill my father, you can't! Uh. You're not Luce. He would never, ever do this. <laughs> you really are an evil wizard. You don't care about anyone but yourself. <laughs> Give me my Luce back. I want him back right now. Do you hear me? Yoko, it is. It is Luce, but I'm different now. I may have a different appearance and personality, but both my counterparts share the same spirit, the same soul. If Luce were to die, I too would die. And whatever Luce loves, I love as well. smell just like you used to. Mm. What do you mean, Yoko? Like laundry soap? So that was the Wizard of Fire. That was Dark Schneider. If we're to survive, we may have to summon him forth again. Yoko, your clothes got all dirty. Do you want me to wash them for you? No, that's okay. Luce, do you like me? Sure, Yoko. I like you a lot. The only spell that could have released such dark power is Venom. But knowledge of that spell was lost when Dark Schneider was killed. Huh? Could he have somehow come back to life? <laughs> Looks like it's time to get some answers. <laughs> 